So if you give the CDC more money, you have to take money away somewhere else in the budget as opposed to a situation that we use for our national defense, our national uh, defense and defense security, uh, where the budget is exempt from those kinds of budget caps so that you can create a long arc of expectation and you can fund what is necessary to get the job done right uh, without having to do all the horse trading that is implicit in the approach to the CDC. So I think at least for the biosecurity component of public health, we're going to need to look at a different structure of the budget. There are several good ideas out there. One, one is to create a system that looks something like the Federal Reserve, where there's a board. And if, if you remember, the Federal Reserve was created, I think, in 1913, in part to avoid the politicalization of our central banking system, but also um, it creates a mechanism for relative independence about financial decisions. And I think something like that might be a model that we need to take a good look at. 